This is the Home Fan Strategy, my name's O4Zaz, and welcome back to more Far Madness. Well, last time we attacked Liv now known as Livonia for one province, and then I real then I converted myself to be a proper feudal king. Well, I've just realised that it caused, caused a lot of problems, because now my domain stuff has basically gone nah! on me. Still, could be worse. Now, I've still a little problem. I've given away all my titles bar one, because one of them... It's still not going to be enough to get me under my demands limit. So, I was having a little look around, and what my plan is going to be is I'm going to take this province, which when it flipped didn't give me hardly anything. And I'm actually going to give him, I'm going to give this guy the title of Ingria. Ingria, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. So, you're going to become a Lord Mayor, because the plan is. I'm going to try and create the Duchy of Estonia when I have the money. And I'm going to create myself a republic here. Because republics give you an awful lot of money and income from being a vassal of yours. Now, other factors now to deal with. Nomad agitation. What? Oh, you guys are going to leave. Because you idiot guys are idiots and didn't bother flipping. Like some of the other people. Actually, no one else is gonna has flipped yet. Also, I've got the problem with the fact that now this faction has got massive. <laughs> Why do you like me yet you're supporting a faction? Dude, what the hell? <laughs> right, is there anyone I can imprison who's part of a faction? High Chief of Prostovov, are you in any of these factions? No. Chief. Random Chief, no. <laughs> right, I found some her for 26 gold. No matter what, we're going to get money out of this as we can. You go, 95 gold. I'm still because they're threatening. <laughs> I'm also 60. I'm going to die at some point soon. Oh, my grandson's come of age, and he's useless. I'm already a kinslayer. It's sort of like an in for a penny, in for a pound sort of moment. Who did you betroth her to, at least? Random High Chief of Jude. Fair enough. Uh, hey, good sir. I know you're a heretic, but do you want to be a vassal? No, nope, it's false religion. Fair enough. Uh, hey, good sir. I heard you want to be a vassal. No? Fair enough. Good sir, do you want to be a vassal? This is realm. <laughs> Anybody want to be a vassal? <laughs> Anybody want to be a vassal? There we go. Chief Tramak of Pronsk. <sighs> right. Which faction is this one which is firing? Oh Jesus, there's a lot of factions or something gone. Yeah, we want to do this. Uh, which faction is this? This is the chief one. 2,587 men. I don't have that many because I've lost quite a lot. Quite a lot. Might have to hire a merc company. A cheap one. But it's still have decent numbers. Can't afford any of them. I will not be blackmailed. Let the war begin. Me and you, spy master. You, my good dear. You, my dear. Should be my spy master. All else is you convert. No, fair enough. <laughs> it's like, yeah, you could be my spy master, but you gotta convert. I like my, I like my get my logic here. Can I? I have no allies. That's possible to call to war. You should have no one. That's annoying. That's bad. <laughs> Commander. I'm going to put you in command, because you're amazing. Gather the troops. All of them. Except for you idiots, you seem to be concerned about marching through. No, I don't march there, you, through there, you numpty. What 
all of you lot gather up there. I mean, like 900 or so troops. Ah, rebels. Flacking. Flacking? Flacking! <laughs> oh, uh, my son died. He died of cancer. So now my new heir is this random chieftain who's unproven. Right. <laughs> Time to select a new person. Nominate. Can't hear him, he's dead. Well. We'll nominate him for now. Scoot myself in prayer and meditation. Didn't gain anything apart from a bit of piety. <laughs> the entire north and west have gone into revolt against me. I would say the south rises again, shall rise again, but unfortunately this is not the south, this is the north. <laughs> and who just died? Oh yeah, my court chaplain was my my son. That's right. Ooh, not bad, not nasty, not nice at all. Happy for now. I actually want the pack, like the faction which was demanding elective to actually go through with its threat. I want that to happen. Elective would be great. It allowed me to flip for through no penalty, effectively. I've got one thousand men here. You're gonna march there. I've got thirteen hundred men here. You're gonna march there. Uh, I'm gonna put you. Come on, you know you're a flanker, aren't you? Yes, you're a flanker. So you go on the flank. You on that flank. You on this flank. Lost quite a few general. Another commander. Uh, do, 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 do. No, we don't want a trickster. <laughs> Tricksters are a pain in the ass to deal with. Okay, you on that flank. We want you leading this army. And him on the flank. There we go. That makes the, that army move a lot faster. Which faction is now dangerous? Elective in succession. In more Divina. I don't want to deal with two elections. But it's sort of what's going to end up happening, isn't it? Oh, who's died? Random chieftain. Oh, it's the chieftain who had the thing. Do you still do you have my axe? Yes, you do. Are you marked for importance? Yes, you are. Oh, the golden mage of China appears to be over. Didn't even get a chance to benefit from it at all. Nothing whatsoever. Oop, I heard a little pop up. Yep. At least it's making each other. Can I do anything from the Tang Empire? Can I request anything? Peace deal. Send a concubine. Who can I send? My daughter. No, I'm not going to do that. I would like to request an artifact, though, from you, good sir. Tang Arm Protector. <laughs> Sex appeal up. <laughs> nice. I'm okay with that. A prestige thing. Ooh, that's quite a lot of prestige, actually, monthly. I'm going to get insane prestige boosts now. Oh, what's happening here? You're all fighting your set of someone else. Fair enough, you're fighting him. Uh, what's my, what can I ask for? Crew and air. <laughs> yes, I want to boost my fertility, fertility up when I have a wife who's incapable of doing that for me. So I'm just going to go and siege your capital. I hope you're okay with that. Mr. Spider. Well, we want to... You as the general, you on the flank, and you on the other flank. Now this is going to be quite interesting. What sort of troops do I have now? I want to check this. Because I realise I can open it up like this. Yeah, I've now got a mostly heavy, more heavy infantry sort of build. Which is going to be good against this guy. Uh, yep. Yeah. Cool. When I when he died, when we win this revolt, I could vote to revoke his that his duke title and give it to the merchant republic I'm planning to build. Get back here, you. Now I'm not gonna be good on the as 
I used to be in this stage. When it comes to the melee stage, I should be incredible. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> An adventure, another adventure troop? Oh, and he died of cancer. Cool. Don't know why I put my half brother in command. He's he does not like me whatsoever. <laughs> Let's march across the borders. Take off my love affair. I've just become friends with another diviner. <laughs> I seem intent. Ask my friend to join the war. Right, my grandson. Marshall, my good man. Marshall. I need to get my daughter married again, don't I? Uh, do, 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 Any heirs for anything? Not really. Um, got any non-aggression packs I can get? No, not really. But I'll take the prestige. I like the fact that I can now, I can actually do this war with my army fully raised and still have lots and lots of money flowing into the coffers. I'm going to catch the troops here. Crush his forces. If I can capture his leader, that'd be great. Nope, I just captured someone else instead. Sweet. Do you want to surrender? Just a flesh wound. I'm fairly sure this is more than a flesh wound. I'm fairly sure it's more than a flesh wound at this point. I love this guy of organisation. Just pursuing him to the ends of the earth. 99%. How about now? Won't give up yet. I don't think I know where you're going. Yeah, get up here. This, but the dragon. That's an amazing name, and you're being attacked by China. <laughs> that badass name. Shame about what's about to happen to you. Let's just take the troops. Burn the apostate. Roman dungeon. Can I ransom him? Seventy gold. Just stay alive for a little longer, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm a monster. It's like, I have a chance to make money. Stay alive. Right. Elective succession, Galvokai succession. I'd say yes to that one if it fired. And I'd say no to that one and then yes to that one. Back to the capital. I have 237 gold. Right, anyone want to be ransomed in the golden ring? Well, we will... We will uh, release you, because we don't care. You're in prison for obvious reasons. Oh! I didn't realise I imprisoned this guy for being an apostate. Whoops! Okay, uh, sir. You're my friend. I want to ransom you guys. You gotta give me something here. Right, what do I do? The send a gift method. 15 gold. Here's 43. Where's my friend? 4. Wait a couple of months for this to tick. Then I can ransom him for all his worth. Country has been converted. What? Does, why don't I suddenly get an extra title from? Or did I just lose a bit of stewardship? I just lost a one point of stewardship, which is knocked it down. Ah, that's a pain. Alright, nephew. We're going to give you. Actually, none of those. I want to hang on to these. We can hang on for now. <laughs> I 
where's my friend? Nope, nope, nope. You, you got the gold to afford to pay yet? Now you do. Why are you Slavic? Ransom him for 70 gold. There you go, my friend. Now convert. True believer, your, your, uh... Oh, no, you're not. Wait, you used to be, you have sympathy for Christendom. Yet you're Slavic. And my friend, I am so confused by this right now. <laughs> right, I'm going to send you the gift of 15 gold, so I can, I can ransom you. For 17. I love the fact that you can cheat your system effectively by doing this. Right, we're keeping the spider in prison. He's going to die in prison as punishment for trying to cause a revolt against me. You're a true believer. Why are you Sunni? Why are you guys Muslim? <laughs> How did you end up Muslim? Are you Muslim? Yes, you are Muslim. My lover was Muslim. There was my problem. <laughs> Lose myself in prayer and meditation. Ended up becoming temperate. Damn! I'm never going to become temperate at this rate. What minor title can I grant? Designated regent. But where's my... T where's my... Who's my heir? You are my grandson. You're pretty good at diplomacy, despite being trained as a soldier. Somehow. So, I'm going to give you all the titles. Like Adrian will be cupbearer as well. Okay, we want elective monarchy. Fine, we'll put in elective succession for you. I'll just choose my son again. Both of these. Ah, damn it! You're gonna get it. Can I imprison you for whatever reason? Yeah, it's on towards me, so yeah. <laughs> I can basically go, nope! <laughs> Not having that happen. Not doing that, mate. Right, what's the other Danish factions? Independence faction. This is the only one who's really dangerous. Put my friend back. My bro. <clears throat> Make us a Musco. Ugh, he's got 3k troops. That's nasty. Are you what religion are you? Slavic! Perfect! <laughs> I know I can't do that anymore. Curses. I can't do a holy order. You already have a contract with someone. Could you release the contract, please? I'm asking for a friend. Called me. Right, uh, put you in command. You on the flank. You on the other flank. And we'll march here. Start reading. Right, my dread also needs something. Not gonna no, I'm not becoming depressed. I'm 63, we're not getting depressed with this. Hmm. I'm to stay. Send the reward out. <laughs> I don't want to piss off. I don't want to piss off China. That's a given. And a lot of grace anyway. And then here comes the host.
Damn host wars. Hey, if you two could end up fighting each other, I'd much appreciate that. <laughs> Nope, oh, you're just gonna catch my army here instead. Looking the fools do not concern me. I'm more concerned my bickerings. Oh, this way. Like that, yes. My courtier the cruel just died a natural death. There you go, that's what I want to see. <laughs> that's what I want to see. I want to see you two fight it out. <laughs> Cheers, buddy. Alright, who's about to attack me? They're about to come for me, aren't they? Yep. Link up all the troops we can. Can I hire the Holy Order yet? No, I can't. Oh, balls. Right, 1800 be enough? Yes. Let's try and get it as cheap as possible, though. <laughs> the war ended inconclusively. Yeah, it's cool having your ass slapped by my ally. By technically, my rebelling vassal? Technically. Uh, who's this? Random vassal. Throw the posse in the dungeon. <laughs> Throw him in dungeon. That's what we're going to keep doing. Somewhere prospers. Trying to end this war before the video ends. Before he realizes what's happening. There we go. And surrender. <laughs> well, that was an easy war. And that should have theoretically secured my t kingdom title under my son. Let me double check. Yep, everyone's voting for him. Because no one wants to vote for the guy in prison. <laughs> Oh, Volga, Volga, Bulgaria, or Morfa shall continue to reign as the supreme power in the northeast until, uh, no doubt, somewhat big, terrifying force will come and murder me. But, I think that's yeah, good to end the episode. Dealing with a couple of volts, fitting to feudalism, last episode. Dealing with the fallout from all of that. And then having all of these people locked up in prison. Good times. But of course, this is the end of the episode. Until next time, this is the Hope Bad Trashy. My name is O4Zaz, and that has been... Let me write there my troops. This has been Morva Madness. Still very, very fun series. I'm very glad I'm doing it.